me. I know they're not the best sound quality. Number one, because I have them. And number two, because I have them. But they're just unbelievably comfortable, and that's why I got them. Because you don't really need to sound for in StarCraft. That would be kind of ridiculous. So here we are. We're going to get introduced to shops in this game. Which are kind of interesting, because they just have guns lying around in vending machines. You'll see. I mean, it's a normal thing. I guess, you know. Here you have to have, like, a gun license, like in America. But I'm not even sure you could have, like, assault rifles in your house. Don't quote me on that. I'm not a legal expert. I'm only, I'm only 15 guys. I'm only 15. But, like, I don't know. This place is kind of weird in that way that you can just buy a gun in a vending machine. Heard from my, from my Polish friend that they have, like, beer and vending machines <laughs> in uh, Poland. Which is kind of awesome in a way. So, like, a three-year-old can go up buy a beer ooh I like that but it's expensive hmm I have to get grenades first off if I ever wanna complete this mission so get some grenades alright we're good we can turn in now let's check out some of these so I sold my SMG didn't I I do not have an SMG no I only have a Scatter gun and a repeater. So let's see. Twelve. What level am I? Am I five yet? No, I'm four. So six would be a little long to wait. Uh, let's see. Patrol SMG. Level four. Decent damage. I'd have to sell something. I'll sell that. Sell that. I think there are some places I can get some money from. Oh god, I hate this. Except I love it. Love it so much. Alright, I guess I can't get it. I guess I'll go back and then complete this mission. See how it goes. Let's go. Follow the yellow brick road. Follow the yellow brick road. Follow, 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 follow the yellow brick road. Follow the yellow brick road, yellow brick road, yellow brick road. Do 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 Yeah, I was in I was in the Wizard of Oz play as a flying monkey. That's right. I'm a cool cat, you know. I was that I was that cool I was that cool twelve year old going to the uh doing a play. Doing a play. used to do plays but now I don't now I just sit on my ass and game all day and do soccer because soccer is a sport I've told so many people this but there's some weird high school magazine called the rise I don't know but there was a poll of high school students and the question was what they were polling was uh, what's the hardest sport to play just to play in general and 46 fucking percent said football okay if you if you play football and you're gonna rage about this to me in the comments you know maybe you shouldn't be on our channel but I respect all viewers and I respect all of your all of your opinions and everything I I love the aspect of like you know pro football people making 30 million dollars to kick a kick a ball into a into a post whatever they call it but like i mean if if you are good enough to make like 10 million dollars for playing a sport go for it i mean i would love to do that if i was a good enough football player i mean i would do that but in a pro football game it, on average, there is 40, I mean, not 46, what, what am I talking about? There's 16 minutes of, like, playtime where people are running on the field. 16 minutes. 
the fastest runner in the world is three miles a minute. I mean, three, like, three minutes, 30 seconds a mile. Even, even if you were the fastest runner in the, in the world, running a single mile, you could only, gotta kill these guys, you could only be running, like, let me do some quick math here, like, less than five miles, or so. But then you have to add in fatigue, and the fact that those guys aren't the fastest mile runners in the world. So you're probably running like a mile a game in football. Soccer, on average, a normal professional runs six miles. Yeah. I mean, hardest sport in the hardest sport to play? I, I don't quite think so. But then again, soccer is not even the hardest sport. Tennis is obscenely hard to play. You know? Basket... I, ba yeah, basketball. Like a, a number one drafted rookie. What? You currently have two slots available? What? Like a number one drafted rookie out of college isn't going to play like five minutes in a game. And that's... Basketball is ridiculously hard. They have like, I don't know, I just, 46% is beyond all me, you know? Basketball is freaking hard. I play basketball too, but not like competitively. just like to play with my friends. Oh well. So, one sec, let me change weapons. Oh, I don't want another repeater. Whatever, I'll keep my scatter gun. I don't know. So, just giving you guys a heads up, you probably by the time I upload this, which is you got it's probably already going to be up, but Andy's doing a another series called Mediocrity, something like that. Uh and it's going to be him playing video games just any game that he's very mediocre at so that'll be lots of fun to watch and here we are I get my first skill point that I can spend so I'm gonna spend it on this one because it's the only one I can so I gain the ability to face walk I can use it by pressing F and what face walk does I do it against the next guy there's a very good part to use it up you transport to like another dimension <laughs> yeah use your imagination uh, pew. you transport to another dimension and like you're going super fast and they can't hurt you for like a couple seconds and you increase that time by adding like points to a certain skill on your skill sheet whatever better than this one no Shit on your reloaded. Whatever. Alright. And. I don't know. I really like this skill. It's very fun. Uh. There we go. And so. Now we get to face the first boss in the game. His name is Nitos. You also learn another very interesting fact about him and the number of appendages he has on his body or genitalia and let's go let's go you woke the wrong dog pretty sure you're not a dog nine toes you also has three balls good to know did that did that come you know did you sew it one of your toes onto your ball sack and that's why you have nine toes but three balls Ah, deformities, incest, you know, incest. So, you know, he's really not that hard a boss. The only thing super annoying about him is these little freaking dogs he has here, skags, which are actually fairly difficult to kill, harder than him. One's pinky, and one is digit. Get it? Pinky digit. 
giggle, giggle, smirk, smirk. There are a lot of puns like that in this game, where they're just like, alright, I get it. So I'm picking up some money here. Spamming letters. Hopefully you can't get me under here, that'd be awesome. Yeah, that's right. That's, oh shit. I think I have some hops. Alright. So it drops a one of those guns where it's practically the same for every single one. It's called the Clipper. It's a repeater pistol. It's isn't it? Is it elemental? If it's elemental, I'll switch. Yeah, it's elemental. So it has a like undercut thing so that it improves your melee damage. And he also has a weapons chest here. Um, is it worth it? Is it worth it? Is it worth it? More than double the fire rates for half the damage. I don't think so. But I'll sell it. I like selling things. It makes me money. I like money. Money, money, money. Alright. I've never noticed that green light. Now it's on fire. Like, 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 like. 